Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and in today's video I'm gonna show you the best laptop settings in Fortnite in chapter 2 season 8. I just overall figured out like a really good config I actually want to give you guys so therefore you don't have to change anything for yourself. I'm just gonna show you exactly how to get it and show you later on the FPS results in game. And without any further ado, let's get straight into this topic. So guys, and as you can see, I already made a whole entire game user settings config for you guys, which you don't even need to change or anything. I already applied the best search resolution for laptop players, which in my opinion is 1200 times 800. And if you later on gonna pay close attention actually to the game user settings itself, you can also see that the 3D scale is on 75%, which is gonna boost our FPS even more, guys. You didn't need to change anything for yourself. Everything is already applied here in those game user settings. And you can see how consistent and good our FPS are here. And in my opinion, this is still really playable. I mean, it still looks okay. And if you actually get like a playable experience, I think this is 100% worth it. So therefore, yeah, you shouldn't really mind too much here. And besides that, guys, I also already applied all of the best colorblind settings for chapter two season eight and all of the other settings I would personally recommend you to actually play on to gain the biggest competitive advantage. And now I'm just gonna show you in a real quick tutorial how you can actually install these game user settings. And yeah, guys, now I'm just gonna show you real quick how to actually apply these best game user settings here for your laptop. And all you guys have to do is click on the first link in the description where you can join my Discord, guys. And now I'm gonna put a file on there which is called laptop game user settings and just simply drag it here onto your desktop once you guys get it here on your desktop just simply double click onto it and drag those game user settings onto your desktop and afterwards what you need to do is open up your windows search bar and type in presenter temp presenter and open up the first file once we're in here we're just going to click onto local press f on our keyboard until we find fortnite game saved config windows client and there we already got here our old game user settings and what we want to do now is just simply right click onto them and delete them real quick no issues here boys at all and then drag the new game user settings into this file and this is pretty much how you do it just simply right click onto it go into properties again and just make sure that the check here under attribute read only is actually set then we're just gonna press ok and that's how you install already these new game user settings for laptops and yeah guys since most of the laptop players are actually playing on integrated graphics i'm gonna show you a quick way how to actually kind of overclock your integrated graphics and all you guys need to do is go into your windows search bar and type in energy until you find the edit power plant setting just simply open it up and go here onto change advanced power settings and once you get this new window here guys um, all you need to do is just simply scroll down a little bit until you find processor power management and there we have now two values in here minimum processor state which are we going to put to 100% and maximum processor state since integrated graphics are built into your CPU guys you just want to make sure that you get a 100% power limit on both of these here guys so therefore yeah your GPU and your CPU are running at 100% which is super important for laptops and yeah once you applied both of these settings here correctly you can just simply press ok here and you already kind of overclocked your integrated graphics and yeah guys if you want some extra steps on how to actually reduce input delay and boost fps please make sure to check out yesterday's video where i show you a few simple windows tweaks to actually gain more fps in chapter 2 season 8 this works for any kind of pc a laptop low end pc high end gaming pc it literally doesn't matter and with that said this is it for today's video if you enjoyed it please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel this would help me out so so much and if you still have any more questions feel free to ask them down in the comment section below I try to answer as many as possible and with that said have a great day have a great night whenever you're watching this and until next time stay awesome I'm out peace